when you import from another database access creates a copy of the data in the destination database without altering the source no connection to the external data source is maintained once the import process is complete on the external data tab in the import and link group click on new data source select from database and then access from the shortcut menu the get external data access database import and link wizard opens in the file name text box type the name of the source database file or click on browse to display the file open dialog box browse to the location and choose the database file select import tables queries forms reports macros and modules into the current database and click on okay if the source database is password protected you are prompted to enter the password the import objects dialog box opens you can import multiple objects in a single import operation click on options to specify additional settings during the import operation you can choose the objects you want to copy control how tables and queries are imported specify whether relationships between tables should be imported and so on in the import objects dialog box on the tables tab select the tables you want to import click on the ones you want to import if you do not want to import any of the records in a table you can choose to import only the table definition if you want to import queries click on the queries tab and select the queries you want to import you can import queries either as queries or as tables If you choose as queries remember to import all the underlying tables along with the queries you can import forms records macros and modules import the underlying tables also to cancel a selected object click on the object again click on okay to finish the operation access copies the data the get external data save import steps dialog box appears select the save import steps check box if you want to save the import steps for future use click on close the import operation does not overwrite or modify any of the existing tables or objects if an object already exists in the destination database then a sequential number is added to the name of the imported object For example if employee already exists the new imported table is named employee 1 see how the relationships have been imported if you like this video please subscribe to our channel